And so he did! And it was good! <laughs> good morning, friends! My name is Brandon Dayton. I'm your humble narrator. Welcome back to Project Zomboid. Yes, we woke up at a decent hour today. Uh, last episode, I, I overslept just a little bit. But we're gonna, we're gonna keep things going. Ain't that right? Ain't that about right? I should uh, repair some of these fences. You can upgrade the the fences, which I think is quite nice. But uh, one priority for me is also grabbing more pallets. I've only got one pallet, which can be used as a, a table for my little doll tea party. But um, yeah, I'm gonna need quite a few more. Because one pallet, it, it just ain't gonna do. One pallet is far too tiny. So I'll figure out what I can offload of all this shit that I have <laughs> and uh, hopefully it's gonna be fine I don't know if it's gonna be fine but I definitely hope a rain poncho we can definitely pack away water bottle I'll keep lighter I should probably keep one so can we drop one drop one is it gonna make me drop both if I drop one I don't know I don't want to leave my lighter out in the rain either because you know the flint get wet or whatever and you can't even use that shit. I mean you can, you just you just gotta wait for it to dry. Look at this fucking tea party dude. Everybody's here. Uh, Yoda, tall Yoda, <laughs> octopus, we got a couple dolls, couple triceratopses. Oh there's another pallet over here as well. Okay so we got two pallets. I'll probably need like two more. And then I'll be happy. Um, I'm gonna move these though. I don't want them to be in the trash pile because they are not trash. They are precious. I didn't realize how precious they were until I had the suggestion. But yeah, four pallets should be about the same size as that table and then I can actually uh, put some stuff on them. Which will help in a way that I can't, uh, I can't fully comprehend at the moment. <clears throat> So let's offload some of these things. What do I need? Hmm. Everything. <laughs> I, I don't want to drop a book until I'm done reading it. Um, I want to put these dollars in a special place. I think that would be quite nice. These shelves are so fucking full. This one's not. Okay. This is my secret s shelf. It's got lots of guns, adult magazines. Keep this hidden from the kids, you know what I mean? Stay out of here, children. This ain't for you. Alright, the doctor's bag is looking pretty empty once I get rid of the, uh... Once I get rid of the money. Yeah, rain poncho and trowel. You can deal with that. 2.8 pounds. The money's not even that heavy. 0 0.06. I think this is also measured in, uh, kilograms. <laughs> I don't know why I keep saying pounds. I guess because I'm American, you know? Um, should I store this stuff? I'm gonna store this stuff somewhere else, somewhere more accessible. Put it outside. Is the is the Molotov gonna get destroyed if it's outside? I don't know. I guess we find out. Put my other uh, implements in here. Can I put a lighter in there? Did it go? Yeah, it did. Exactly what I wanted. Wonderful job, Project Zomboid. You're a mind reader. You're a wizard! You're a wizard, Harry. You're a Harry wizard. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Um, I wanted to put... I guess Axe can go here. I'm not gonna need that for now. I should probably need a new bat. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna head down to the, uh, the warehouses and see if I can't find a pallet there. It really uh, slips my mind where most of the pallets that I found have been. But they're not that hidden away. They seem sort of plentiful, at least. And we're pretty well unweighted. I guess I don't need this compass either. I don't find myself using that too much. I'll stuff some nails in there just to get a little more space. Mm, water. I kind of want to fill it up. But not from the, the poison. Not from the poison one. Kettle of water. How's it dirty again? 
Didn't I clean this for you guys? Okay, nobody drink the tea. The tea is poison. <laughs> uh, but the octopus is probably used to that, you know. He's seen some nuclear shit. Nuclear! Nuclear, bruh! Alright, come in here, fill up my water bottle so I don't get too dirty. Get a little drinky drink. Alright. Now we on the road. On the way. Do 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 do. On the way. Oh no, wait. I need to get a fucking a new baseball bat. I'm sure I have some at the the base up there. But yeah, we need to go to the main highway, I do think. So we'll pass by the restaurant base. We'll stop in. I'll grab a bat or something. And uh, who wants to hold my bat? You can have this for now. I'll probably regret doing this. But now we got no weapons. Do I run faster with no weapon? It seems like I run a bit faster. Hmm. Maybe that's a, a good secret for making better time to the mall. Yeah, look at that. Your arms go back and forth. You're like, choo-choo! Pain train, bitch! Coming through! Alright, ten baseball bats? Yeah. I probably just need the one. Thanks. It is in good condition. Could put some nails in it for more damage. But then it breaks quicker, doesn't it? Doesn't it? At least that's my theory. I'm pretty sure it's correct, though, through my, uh, through my ventures. I don't remember where I put things, but I do remember what happens with items. I'm like, hmm, I put some nails in this bat and I thought it would last longer, and it didn't. I mean, I guess it makes sense. If you drive a nail through a piece of wood, you kind of compromise the integrity of the wood, in a way. If you drive multiple nails through the wood, you compromise the integrity more. Yeah? I think so. I think that's how it goes. Oh, look at this sniper weapon system. What the fuck? Oh. There's only three bullets for it, but it says sniper. Sniper! I want to be a sniper! Oh god, it's so heavy. Even in the bag. Alright. Go back to the base one more time. Oh god, and it's raining now. Is it? Is it raining? Yeah, it's raining. Fuck. My. Ass. <laughs> please don't, though. Please don't, please do it. Come on, you can put a shirt on while you're walking. I know you, you haven't probably tried it before, but I have. My wife yells at me and she's like, We gotta go! We got 15 minutes! And I'm like, it's... It's on Filipino time, okay? Nothing here starts on time. We've got plenty of time. But she's like one of the only punctual Filipinos. <laughs> Which is something that I absolutely love her for. Oh, but she, she gets a little, uh, a little stressed kind of easy. We gotta go! Oh, come on, baby. Chill out. Relax. How can I relax? Don't you want to go to your daughter's, uh... What? Little show? And I'm like, well, she's in first grade. It's not going to be Shakespeare. Yes, I want to go, but I'm not going to I'm not going to freak out about it. Everything's fine. Everything's awesome. Everything is cool when you're part of a team. I was going to put this in that locker, but I'm decided against it. I've got plenty of things here that I need to do. How do I have so many sheet ropes? What the fuck? Question mark? Hmm. Oh well. I would also like a, a box or something to store my money in. Oops, gunshot. That would be quite nice, I think. Pretty helpful. Oh god, and now it's raining. We've got to be careful. We've got to sneak through the back way. Do 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 do. Any food in here? No. This is the post office. <laughs> you can eat paper! It'll fill you up, uh, but it won't give you any nutrients. So if you eat paper for too long, you will die. Sorry to inform you. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news. I think there was a, a story like that. <clears throat> a bunch of people trapped on an island, and they're like, Oh, we can just eat grass. Well, yeah, you can. But the grass isn't going to uh, 
It's not going to nourish you. <clears throat> you will end up dead from eating grass. So if you didn't know that, uh, that's a thing you know now. There's so much stuff in this hardware store. We had to make a mental note of this. I think I had uh, gone there previously. I'm basically just trying to uh, avoid the rain. So I'm ducking into places. Yeah, I don't think we're going to make it all the way to the warehouse before I end up getting hypothermia or some shit. The rain poncho helps just a little bit, but um, you're still going to get wet. See that? See that little moodle? You're damn. I guess I am. Oh, we made it to the warehouse. This is a lot closer than I remember. Okay. So we're cool. Still a little hungry, but relatively cool. Um, let's see if there's any bad boys in here. This place usually has a fridge. These little huts. Everything seems to have, like, at least a mini fridge. But not this place. I'm gonna sit down and rest for just a minute as well. Couldn't hurt. Although it will make my uh, peckishness even worse. So, not for too long. Just long enough so I can keep running. Holy shit. What are you doing, bitch? Get down. None of this. Beta blockers. I'm going to take these. Just so I'm uh, not as nervous. Let's have a little listen. I heard some banging, but I don't hear it anymore. So I guess we're okay. Here's some goods. Let's see if I can find what I'm looking for. What you waiting? What you waiting? What you waiting? What you waiting for? Do 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 do. Green paint. Hmm. I'm curious if I could paint my house. That would be quite nice, wouldn't it? Used to paint plastered walls. Oh, I gotta plaster the walls first. Yeah, I guess that makes good sense. Maybe. Actually, no, it doesn't. Talk to Tom Sawyer. He painted a wood fence, bruh. My house is made of wood. Used to plaster high-level wooden walls. Requires a bucket of water. I'm tempted to grab this just to see uh, how much how much plaster is in there. How many walls I can do. Hmm. It might be a good experiment. But only if I can't find any, any pallets or what I'm looking for. Lots of paint. Hmm. Tent kit. That's interesting. I guess this would be good if I'm uh, in the middle of nowhere. Like I've been a couple of times and needing some, some shelter. I can carry my own shelter on my back like a turtle. Okay, let's start in this one. Shovel, trowel, no, no. I don't want any of these things. Mm, empty gas can, dish towel, underwears. Nobody's got a fucking pallet for me. Come on. Come on! Paintbrush. I guess we'll need that for when we uh, decide to start painting things, right? That makes good sense. Dogs going ape shit outside. What else is new? Lighter, sweater. Hmm. Maybe I remembered wrong about this place. Doesn't seem to be much for me here. Shop vac. Hmm. If you need me, I'll be downstairs with the shop vac. You can call, but I probably won't hear you. Because it's loud with the shop vac on. That's a Jonathan Colton reference. Most people know Jonathan Colton, don't they? From uh, Left 4 Dead, at least. I discovered him a couple years earlier than Left 4 Dead through a little game called Audio Surf. Oh snap, anybody remember Audio Surf? That game was the tits! Haven't uploaded any episode because copyright strike. <laughs> Every single time, copyright strike. So, uh, it's not gonna happen. Here's a bucket. I'm basically uh, preparing to get the plaster powder because I've already kind of given up on the fact that we might find a pallet here. They're quite rare, I do see. WD-40. I need a WD-40 and a tap and die, said Hank Hill. In the, I think that's the first episode of King of the Hill. 
I'm a really big King of the Hill fan, if you didn't know that. I think it's a good old American show. I'm gonna take this plaster powder. Now there's a cat going ape shit outside the other window, so I don't know what the fuck is going on here. There has been uh, some typhoons in the Philippines recently, as you might have noticed from the fucked up audio from one of my other <laughs> episodes. What am I doing? What am I doing now? I'm trying to find some paint, that's what I'm doing. Green paint! It's kinda heavy, but I think we could do it. Oh, nope, nope. I need to move some stuff around. Put the tent kit in the other... in the other bag. That should be okay. As long as I got enough room for a pallet. I think a pallet of wood is like 12 pounds, so yeah. We should still be able to fit it. If I do this uh, correctly. And we might not even need it, because apparently there's there's no pallets around here. I don't have any food either. I didn't bring no snackies. I'm kind of grateful for the rain, because I don't have to waste my time watering shitty zucchinis. What did we plant? Was it zucchinis again? I'm getting so tired of zucchinis. Ugh. Oh god. Maybe there's something in here for me. Let's check it out. Let's have a little look-see. Some planks. Bungee cord, hammer, ice chest, oxygen tank. Nope, nope, nope. Fish food, chicken wire. I should probably make a chicken coop. That would be a nice sustainable source of food. But I've got my, uh, my blinders on right now. And I really just want what I want. Can't you see? I just want my thing. Pallet of gray bricks. Okay. I'll do this, and then I can offload all the fucking gray bricks. Because it's way heavy, bruh. Super heavy, dude. Hmm, another bag of plaster powder. Well, at least we got one pallet. Unpack. And I've got 79 gray bricks. What the fuck? Oh, there was a hundred of them. But most of them ended up on the floor. So here, the rest of them can go on the floor, too! I don't know what you make from gray bricks. We could pack it. Thick rope, wooden pallet, gray brick. Huh. Well, I'll keep this thick rope for later, when I need to hang myself. <laughs> Alright, so that's one pallet down. And, um... We just need one more. And probably more than that would be helpful, but... I'm not keeping my fingers crossed for it. Here's some banging in here. Ah, oh, is that a pallet? Yes, it is, but not one that I can pick up. <laughs> okay, great. How helpful. Let's check these boxes. Come here, boxes. I want to have a look-see. Battery. It's got a pretty good charge on it, but we're not here for batteries right now. Blinders. Remember? Fucking blinders. Charcoal. Ah, oh, here's some food. MRE. Mm. Pallet of stones. Yes. I will take this. Thank you so much for this one. Most helpful. And for some reason I can hold all the stones. Even though they're going to break my fucking back. <laughs> no, 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 no. Let's not do that. Let us not do that now. Uh, thick rope. I don't need this shit. Whatever. I just want the pallet! Ooh, pallet of logs. Can I fit this? I do want a pallet of logs. So that'll be nice. And then I could find one more. I need a fucking even number of pallets. Don't you understand? Here's another pallet. Yeah, this was the place to go. Whoop whoop! Dayton making the good choices for once! Hell yeah, boy! Drop all these. Pick rope. Floor. And, uh, we've got a good amount of wood pallets, I do think. Well, yeah, we've got four. So I guess that's fine. I'll eat the rest of this up. And then I need to, uh, head back to the, the fishing base. Or the tea party base, if we prefer to call it now. Because we don't do much fishing lately. It's kind of sad. I built it for a purpose, and now it has another purpose. Or is that sad? Is that just evolution? 
Oh, brained bitch! I'll see you later. Yeah, I forgot how close this place was. I guess it's pretty far from the fishing shack, but from the restaurant base, it's uh, it's not too bad. We got that done up pretty nice. Although it is uh, a little more packed with zombies than I remember it. But then, most things are, aren't they? Hmm. It's okay. Zombies need a home too. A home outside. A home away from home. Where the homeless people roam. And you hit them with baseball bats all day. Home, home is quite strange. There's lots of zombies wandering street. That doesn't make any sense. That's, a, that's bad English. When you write a song, you should do good English. <laughs> that's basic. That's fucking basic. Write this shit down. I wonder if there's pickles in that food market. I should stop by and look for pickles. I just love the pickles. Tickle my pickle. I think I said that the last time we were looking for pickles too. But that's okay. Same shit, you know what I mean. There's lots of nails. Bag of concrete. Concrete powder. Ooh, well. Take a dollar bill. Can we fit the dollar bill? Yes. Yes, we can always fit more money. Ha ha! Hmm. It's a good amount of non-perishables in here. And yeah, this stuff is uh holding for some reason or another. I don't quite understand why, but it's not going to do any better in my hands than it is in that fridge. Or in the other fridge that I have in the base. You know? Then it'll be out of the cold for a while. And it, it just might end up rotting. Rotting in my hands. Or in my backpack. My hands are full at the moment. Lipstick and perfume? Ooh! What's that, girl? You got a hot date or something? Huh? Well, you know why they call me Dayton, don't you? <laughs> it's a horrible joke. It's a horrible joke. I, I I got called that in high school. I heard that joke, and uh, I thought it was equally stupid then. <laughs> Probably I'm a little uh, biased, though, because it's my name. I'm like, eh, don't make fun of my name, faggot. But, yeah, that's kids for you. That's just kids, you know. They like to make fun of each other or whatever. Stuff happens. I got a bunch of logs. Do I need to build anything? Hmm. Got a whole pallet of logs now. And what else did I pick up? Yeah, that plaster powder, paint brush. I think I'm gonna stick this on the outside of the house too. And uh, I'm gonna need to expand the table, so... There will probably be quite a bit of moving of all this all this stuff on the floor. I don't have that many shelves outside. Hmm. A shame that. But it's okay. <clears throat> Plaster powder, you go here. Bucket, you go here. Green paint will go as well. Paint brush. There we go. I think that cat is in heat. It's like, somebody come fuck me! <sighs> no. I'll fuck you with a bat. <laughs> Shut your fucking mouth! It's just, the slide's a bit distracting. It just, uh, is off-putting for me a little bit. <clears throat> Tent kit, I guess that can go here too. This is my manly shelf, full of man things! You know how to plaster a wall, son? You know how to spackle? Do you know how to spackle? You don't even know how to spackle, do you? <laughs> well, it sounds really manly. Sounds really manly when you spackle stuff. <laughs> I like when you spackle me. Spackle me, daddy. Oh god. Four log stack. Okay, this can go here. Whatever. That's pretty nice, isn't it? I'll put thick ropes there too. Keep it all relatively organized. Holy shit, what are you doing over here, fuckhead? Nobody invited you to the tea party? Get out! Get the fuck out! Alright, but he did bring sunglasses. Maybe that'll be cool for the Halloween party. 
It's gonna be Halloween pretty soon in Project Zomboid. Can I move this table somehow? Disassemble. Disassemble, reassemble. Let's pick it up. Requires hammer. I have a hammer. Don't worry. I got a fucking hammer. Why, why are you gonna tell me no? Yeah, chance to break, 30. <laughs> Roll those dice, son. That's gonna be just fine. And I did get it. Poor quality table. Oh, that's so nice. Let's place. Place our poor quality table. Uh, where do where do I want to put it? I'll put it back with his friends. <laughs> hey, you remember Larry, guys? It used to be a tree, but he's a table now. I hope you can still accept him. <laughs> oh, eventually the trees are going to grow all around that shit. I'll forget that it was ever there, and I'll be like, Why? Why is there a table here? This doesn't make any sense. Okay. There's one pallet. Two pallet. Nope. I'm gonna get pretty frustrated with this, I think. I just had to make it all fucking perfect, didn't I? Didn't I? Grab one. Grab the correct one. You didn't grab the correct one. <laughs> oh boy. This is not gonna be good. Okay, let's see if I can do it like I did the cups. And uh, hopefully that'll work a little better. Not quite. Um, just take this one. Oh god. It's doing it in the wrong order. Why? Oh, it's gonna be so frustrating. Oh god. This is not gonna work out the way that I thought. Hmm. Okay. Well, 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 well. You guys, you don't mind if your table's like a little fucked up, right? I'm doing my best here, but I, I don't know if my best is good enough. I don't know if my best is gonna be good enough. I'm sorry. Yep, it's a little lopsided table. That's okay. Everything's okay here. I just wanted you guys to, to have a good time, you know? Come on down to the party. If I grab one, it's gonna grab the first one I place, which I think is the one that's under this. Yeah. Alright. I know how you work now. I know how your brain do. It's still a little fucked up. Try again! God damn it. <laughs> I'm I'm way too OCD to be doing this. I should just put one pallet and be like, okay, it's good. <clears throat> but for some reason I can't. I can't just leave it. Can't just call it good. Here, what if the table goes this way a little bit? Oh, that is fucking perfect. That's exactly what I want. It's all lined up extremely well. Oh, but for some reason I don't think I'm going to be able to repeat that miracle. Alright, try it. Try it. Disappoint me. <laughs> I'm ready. Hmm, maybe if I made the table like this way a little longer? I, I don't know how I did that at all. Jesus Christ. Lord in heaven, please help me. And so he did! And it was good! <laughs> okay, uh, one more side to the table. I guess that's fine. Isn't it? I'm not gonna fuck around with it for too long. There, that's, that's looking nice. Well... That last one I don't like, but... Mm, it's gonna have me grab the wrong one, isn't it? Whatever. 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 <laughs> Let's get some mugs. Here you go, here you go guys. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put the mugs on the table for you. And just try to keep track of which one's which. Who got the tea? Mr. Triceratops got tea? Wow. Ain't you fancy. And I hope you guys don't mind that I'm uh, probably going to leave the food on the floor until we can expand the table a little bit longer. There we go. I'll just place these. Place these like a normal person. There we go. Everybody gets one. 
except the people that don't. <laughs> Alright, that's looking a little strange, but <laughs> whatever, it'll all come out in the wash. It's fine. I'm not going to complain. <clears throat> I did the best I could. Oh, that's right, we got a tea beverage as well. Guess who gets the tea, Mr. Hippo? Oh god, and then there's that mug of water that's under there. Hmm. Can I just... a little bit, and then... also? Okay, somebody's mug is under the table. You guys understand what I'm trying to do. God damn it. Maybe I'll fiddle with it, eventually. Probably not, though. <laughs> Oh, that's uh, a bit of frustration. Why can't it just be like uh, placing walls or something like that? I guess because that would be fucking stupid. <laughs> I guess because that's fucking ridiculous. Uh, yeah, you can grab stuff off the floor, even though that's kind of uh, less intuitive. Hmm. I don't know. I ain't got a good explanation. All I know is I want to do some fishing. Let's check this trap here. See if we can get some little fish. Little bait fish. Nice to see ya. Wonderful. And I'm just hoping that the trap don't break. Wow, we got 15 of them already. And a broken trap. Excellent. Wonderful. Let's keep going then. See if the rest of these traps will break. See, some of them only have three, one had five, one had fucking ten. That doesn't make much sense, now do it. No. No, sir, not one bit. Check this here trap. I'm getting hungry. I'm getting hungry, I want I to wanna eat. We gotta catch some fishes. They're so delicious. Actually, I could probably eat some of these fish. Because they're not dangerous when they're uncooked. So let's do that. We got 40 of these little fuckers. That's enough for a good meal, isn't it? I guess. I'll share some of them with all them fish that are waiting out there in the waters. <clears throat> Asking me to assist them? Well, I will assist you, but you will pay. With your life! Aha! Some late night fishing. It's like I talked about in the last episode, but I didn't do. Didn't do it. Can't afford it. That's fine. <clears throat> we don't have to do everything the same day. What does time even mean anymore? You know what I mean? Time is pointless, man. We're just keeping track of the days for no reason. Shit makes no sense. We got a small pike. <clears throat> That's gonna feed me pretty good. Can I get another one? No, I got some socks. All right, we're good. We're good, we're good, don't worry about it. Put the socks in the pile. I think I wanna go uh, cook this thing up too. Very heavy load. I'm not worried about that. Not one little bit. Doctor's bag goes secondary, so I'm not overweighted. Or not as overweighted, I guess. Hmm, put this away. Put my hammer away. Wire. Don't necessarily need that. Hey, bitch. <laughs> I brained her with a fishing pole. Don't fuck with me. <laughs> Good job. This fishing pole's more dangerous than I thought. Alright. Let's do a little bit of cooking. A little bit of loving. Something from the oven. Can we cook the whole fish? Oh, I'm getting drowsy now. Uh oh. I guess I need to prepare this fish in order to cook it. Alright, that's fine. I get it all figured out. Yeah, you don't want to cook a fish that has like the scales on it and all that shit. It's probably not a great idea. I ain't no fish scientist or whatever. But it's probably something that you don't want to do. This cook's pretty nice. A little bit faster. Just because I fast forward the time. <laughs> Ha 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 ha! Oh, I am a god! <laughs> Let's uh, eat one of these. I hope you're not gonna sit there and eat them both, fucking pig. <laughs> All right, well fed, well fed, and that makes me even more sleepy. So I could sleep in that house like a normal person, 
But I'm going to sleep in my drafty wooden base because... Because I built it. Because it makes me feel awesome because I built it. So I want to sleep there. And my bag's getting a little bit more loaded up with shit. The tea party looks okay from like way out here. Then you zoom in and you see the little nuances split in the table and whatnot. And I think I do want to make all of these tea because you can see the little uh, steam rising off that. Or is that just a tea bag? I guess it's just a tea bag. Regardless, it makes things look better, which is um, primarily the goal. You might not believe that because uh, it looks kind of like shit. I just threw everything on the floor. But uh, I, I do sincerely mean that I'm going to probably take take a day off of uh, recording in Project Zomboid and just be like, okay, here you go. Everything's a little more organized now. And then people will be like, Dayton, why are we one day closer to uh, Halloween? I can see in the upper right what day it is. And they'll just say, because I, cause I skipped one. I skipped one to fix the fucking tea party, and I'm sorry. But it's probably not going to be in the next episode. I'll have to <laughs> I'll have to find the motivation to do it, which I just don't have at the moment. And, uh, yeah, I might not for a while. So it could just stay like that until I get some more pallets, and then I'll say, oh, I really got to readjust this. Anyways, enough rambling. Time for Betty Buys. I hope that you'll like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy this episode, friends. Thank you so much for watching. It really helps the channel to get out there. And, um, yeah, leave a nice comment and I will answer back because that is something that I enjoy as well. Anyways, this has been Project Zomboid. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. Thank you once again for watching. I truly do mean that. And I'll see you in the next one, friends. Until then, bye bye one, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.